Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, playing some more Pokemon Swoosh. Last time, uh, we took on the Ballon Lee Gym and succeeded, and got a super cute outfit out of the bargain, so that's awesome. Um, this time we're gonna start by thinking about a little bit of a viewer request. Um, it's actually from episode 19. Uh, I haven't published episode 20 yet, so episode 19 is the most recent, uh, that you've seen. At the time I say this, but by the time you actually watch this, you will have seen episode 20. <laughs> Having a, a, like, a backlog of videos can get confusing sometimes, huh? <laughs> anyway, uh, I had a viewer request here, uh, to go talk to that person. Who is in this town is in, uh, Hammerlock. Uh, so we will be going over there to talk to them. Uh, however, I did try to do this off camera, just to, to make sure, like, I knew where they were. And it turns out there's a cutscene on the way, so we'll have to look at that first. Uh, so we're here, uh, they are in this direction. Firstly, cutscene. Come to gawk at me that I've had my challenge ban taken away and my gym challenger status revoked. Can you really afford to waste time like this? Of course. Well, I suppose so. You don't have to worry about catching up with me after all. I'll have you know, though, that I haven't given up. I must become the champion in order to help out the chairman. I will go and ask him to let me rejoin the gym challenge. Mm, good luck with that. Oh, hi. Hmm, that boy. Now that's what I would call pink. So sincere and straightforward, and yet so twisted and misguided. I like it. That's the kind of thing that gives people some depth. Are you gonna make him the new leader? He said. Time for my gym mission, child. Huh? What? Pink. Pink. And pink. Congratulations, child. Um... Miss Opal? What in the world has gotten into you? You were used by Uliana, am I right? You worked hard to gather wishing stars for her, only to have her throw you away like a rubbish once she was done with you. Come with me, child. I might be able to help you out. Of course, it all depends on how much hard work you're willing to put in, too. Are you... are you testing me? Very well, I accept. In fact, I plan on making sure you see my full talents, and tell me everything you know about the wishing stars. Farewell for now, child. You should head to Kerchester. Sir Chester? I take it you know how to get to Route 7. Okay, I'm wearing pink too. Like... Do, can, can, do I not get to be the gym leader? Come on. <laughs> oh my goodness. Anyway, uh, the person we want to talk to, uh, in accordance with Nikki's request, is up here. There they are. H Hello there. You look like someone I might trust. You see, there's someone I fancy and I, I... I've written him a love letter. Do you think you might deliver it for me? Of course. Oh, thank you, thank you. I'm so glad I found someone like you to help me. My name is Paula. Here you are. This is the letter I want you to deliver. You obtained an old letter. Why is it old? How long ago did you write this, Paula? Like, you're just a child, right? You put the old letter in your bag's key items pocket. Entrusted to you by a girl to be delivered to a boy. Strangely, it looks old to you. That was my point, yeah. Okay, so, that character is a girl, I wasn't sure. Um, but yes. Deliver it to Frank for me, will, won't you? Frank in Ballonlay. That's who you want. Frank Ballonlay, Ballonlay, something like that. Frank, okay. Yeah, I'll find him. Okay, so I can see why you told me to talk to this person, because, yeah, there's a little bit of a side quest here. Um, let's head back to Ballonly and Ballonlay, however it was pronounced. Let's head back there, to the prettiest town, which is over here. Let's go. Oh my gosh, I really like the design of this place. Where is Frank? Are you Frank? Frank? 
That's my granddad's name. Oh. Oh, did we just get a letter from a little ghost girl? Oh. Uh, we already talked to you, yeah. So is it you? You're looking for Frank? That'd be me, yes. What's this? You've got a letter addressed to me. You handed the old letter to the old man. He doesn't look that old. Like, like he's an adult, sure, but like he's not got grey hair or anything. He's looking pretty spry for his age. <laughs> now who could be sending me letters? Oh, why, this says it's from Paula. That does take me back ages. Paula was the name of a girl I spent all my time playing with when I was a young lad. She fell ill, didn't tell me though. She kept it a secret just how sick she was. We ended up having a great row about it. Then I moved away not long after that fight. I never met her, I never met her again after the day I left. H how was she? Did she look well? Dear old Paula. I mean, I'm pretty sure she was a ghost, but she looked well. That's a comfort to hear. I reckon I ought to give you something for this gift you've brought, for you brought me back a piece of my youth. A choice scarf. I'm going to be held by a Pokémon. This curious scarf boosts speed, but only allows the use of one move. Interesting. Twinsies. Uh, let's get back and talk to Paula again, now that we've done that, and see what effect that had. Do -do -do -do. Here we are in Hammerlock, let's go. I love cycling up a flight of stairs. She's gone. Oh my god. Was that her unfinished business? Oh, sweetie. Oh my goodness. Okay, um... Let's just pr proceed with the game now, but it's just... I'm a little shaken, um... Oh, hello. Hey, uh, the badge collecting going well? I've been doing some research on the ruins and stone side. The sword and shield? What kind of Pokémon were they, and where are they now? I still have so many questions. I was thinking about taking another look at the tapestries in... Are you kidding me? What was that? Hammerlock Stadium shook. That's where Chairman Rose's power plant is, isn't it? Huh? A power spot? I'm getting readings from the power spot detector. Does that mean Dynamaxing is possible here? Hey, Sonia. And Danielle too, right? You felt the shaking, right? Seems Chairman Rose is testing something again. This is bad. Pokémon might start Dynamaxing right in the middle of Hammerlock. Is that so? I can make sure the Chairman knows. You will get lost, Leon. I'm going too. <laughs> Leon is useless with directions. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to seeing you compete in the finals, so you should leave the investigation on the quaking to the adults. Head to Kirchester and get that gym bad. Sirchester? Kirchester? Kirchester? I don't know. I mean, I'm an adult. Oh, Danielle. Hi, Hop. There's so much going on on this side. <laughs> First that forest, then that mad quiz. I've been lost in every sense of the word. But it looks like I've finally caught up to you again. Come with me to Route 7. I could use a bit of competition to motivate me. Alright. If you say so. I wonder if there's something special about people who find wishing stars. Maybe. You're cute though, is my point. Oh hey, another Pokemon Center. How many are there in this town? Like three? I go to a hair salon every day in order to maintain my hairstyle. 
Um, have you seen your hairstyle? It's, uh, 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 it's, it's not worth it. <laughs> I mean, look at that. <laughs> Trainers who become champion are just too strong. I feel like challengers should be given some handicap, like having a 10 Pokemon team. Oh, I see. The, the champion would have six and the challenger would have ten. I see. I trying to figure out exactly what that meant. I do my job every day while imagining how strong each passenger on the train must be. Alright. Uh, let's try a little ID just in case. Yeah, I didn't think I'd get it. It's worth a try though. Booping a snood. Boop, boop, boop a snood. Uh, we're all full? Yeah, I just wanted to make sure. So, yeah, this game has. Sorry, this town has three Pokemon centers. Yep. Look, one, two, three. Gee, Hammerlock, how come your mom lets you have three Pokemon centers? Did you. <laughs> Seems a bit excessive. Route 7. I mean, you can't get a random encounter anywhere in the town, so theoretically there's no danger of just walking a little bit further. Unless poison is really bad in this game? I don't really know. Alright, Danielle. You and I both know I've got to keep trying different strategies if I'm going to get strong enough to catch up to Lee. No, not just catch up. If I want to surpass him. So I think you know what's coming, mate. Let me try out my latest in a battle against you. You were challenged for a Pokemon Trainer Hop. I bet he's still not very good at the game. Trevenant? Oh, it's a tree. Go on, Cynthia. I know you can do it. I, I don't know what type Trevenant is. Alright, time for me to test exactly how far I can go with my latest and greatest team. Uh, let's try Liquidation. I, it might be Grass type, but I, I don't know. It might also be Rock type, like Pseudo Wudu. Not very effective. Okay, so it is grass type. That answers that. Confuse Ray. Became confused. Uh, U turn? Cool. Now I can bring out a fire type, of which I have several. Uh, we probably want Carl. Yeah. I'll heal them a little bit. Yeah, not much. It's all right. Oh, they're faster than me. Which is kind of weird because I'm like a super quick minecart or whatever. But, eh, doesn't matter. Should be fine. It's super effective. The way you battle. You know, it kind of reminds me of Lee. Goodbye, Trevenant. Uh, Boltun. I'm guessing that's electric? Uh, let's, let's stay with Carl for the moment and see how we do. Oh, it's, it's the puppy! Uh, yeah, we'll just use another incinerate for now. Oh, Crunch. That's a good move. Electricity's good against water, right? Um, I don't have anything that's super effective. Blub, 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 blub. Okay, that's gonna take me out. I was hoping the speed drop would make me go first, but it wasn't enough. That's okay, though. 
Uh, let's switch to Gareth. Yeah, so we can use some more fire abilities. Puppy. Uh, fire Fang, probably. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Goodbye, Bolton. Bada bada. Snorlax. What type of Snorlax? Normal? What's good against normal? Dark, I think? Let's try Crunch. That didn't do anything. Um. That's not good. Consider the possibility your opponent might land a critical hit on your Pokemon, mate. Uh... I thought Retaliate would do a lot more than that, but it didn't. Okay, that takes out Gareth. We should be okay, though. We're just going to spam our most powerful move. <laughs> Is the creation special? No, it's physical. Okay. So it... It doesn't get affected by stockpile. Uh, cool. Heat more? That sounds like a fire type. <laughs> it's super effective. Bada bada. Bada bada. Cinderace. Yeah, Cinderace is also fire type. I'm the kind of guy who gets fired up to win in these situations. That is a very cute bunny. I'm so sorry, cute bunny. Rubbish. My team can't perform if I can't get my own head straight as their trainer. Money. <laughs> Before we ever started out on this journey, I remember watching Lee on the telly. He was like a bright star, so strong I could hardly bear to look right at him. But now I can tell just how strong he really is, and what he's got that I haven't. But I'm getting stronger too. Maybe not as fast as you, but fine, whatever. Thanks for letting me battle with you again. And here, I'll heal up your team for you too. I mean, I was just gonna walk back to the Pokemon Center, because there's like three of them in the in the town just there. I think I know what it is I really want. I want to battle Lee. I want to take on my bro. But not just that, I want to beat him. I want to be the one who beats the unbeatable champion. And I'm going to. My mind's made up. You and me are gonna have another battle once I get my gym badge in Kirchester. Alright. I was just in the mood to do a little spin. Oh, you're cute. I like your design. Hello. As a model, I show off the appeal of my partner, Pokemon. You're challenged by model Mila. Oh, look at her haircut. Oh, what a cutie. Oh my goodness. Ribombi, eh? Oh, what another cutie. Oh my gosh. So many cuties. Uh...
What type is a Rombi? Fairy? Uh, well, liquidation did the trick. Vespiquen. Let's keep the current Pokemon. Pressure. Exerting its pressure. I don't know what that does. Defend order. Defense rose? Special defense rose? Uh, well I guess I'll attack again. No reason not to. Yeah. <laughs> A critical hit. <laughs> oh my goodness. Bada ba dum. Bada ba dum. I sure did. What a great trainer you are. You really showed off the appeal of your partner Pokemon. I got money for winning. Da 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 da. Oh, hello, Kitty. Do I already have one of you? Lipod. Lyopod? Apparently, I don't have one of you. Uh, let's try to damage you just a little bit. Maybe a bit more than that. Hmm. Please don't do too much damage. I really gotta teach someone false swipe already. Dang it. That was too much. How about him? <laughs> oh, hello. You just can't silence Team Yell. She's cute, she's tough, she won't take no one's guff. Oh, money, she's our money. I can't go that way because there's some partying going on. <laughs> okay, let's try to catch another Lipard. Uh, you know, something here. A Balm Mushroom. Okay, if I just use Snipe Shot, does that do enough damage without defeating it? Let's find out. Ooh, no. No. Critical hit. Damn it. <laughs> Level up. Not what I had in mind. Uh... <laughs> Oh, hello. I think I already have one of you. Thievil. You have a little mustache. It's cute. Uh, I think I'm a bit over leveled for doing this. Might need to switch my starter. My my start not my left. My starter, my leader. Nasty plot. What does that do? Special attack rose sharply. Interesting. Uh, let's see if that's enough damage. Uh... Yeah. Gotcha. The evil was caught. Fox Pokemon. With a lithe body and sharp claws, it goes around stealing fox food and eggs. Bolton is its natural enemy. Yep. I was gonna go with Sly Cooper. Let's see if it fits. That's probably too long. No, it fits. Cool. <laughs> Cool beans. Uh, kind of running low on PP, so I'm just gonna dash back over here a little bit.
Thanks, nurse. Da 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 da. Okay, there's something else there now. What is that? Oh, it's a terrifying spider. Galvantula. Is it like electric type? I'm guessing probably. I'm gonna try liquidation, which should be not super effective. Uh, hopefully that'll be just enough to... Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. Galvantula was caught! It lays traps of electrified threads near the nests of bird Pokémon, aiming to snare chicks that are not yet good at flying. Well, that's terrifying. Uh... Luigi, as in Galvani. <laughs> there we go. Oh, hello. Shelmet. Isn't that a thing from Mario Maker? Um, let's try a snipe shot. I don't know. I don't know what I'm looking at here. No idea. Okay, it's in the red. That worked. As a strange physiology that responds to electricity, when together with Carablast, Shaman evolves for some reason. Carablast, okay. Spiny? Spiny Shelmet? Is it to Mario Maker reference? <laughs> Hello, Inkay. Oh, it's a, it's a cool Splatoon reference. I see what you did there. I don't have one of those yet. Um, let's try Snipe Shot. I don't know what type it is. Probably Water something, but I don't know. Ooh, that's too much. Would be real helpful to have false swipe. Oh, hello. I know you. Oh, you're not what I expected. I saw a gal a gal gal galvantula on the battlefield, but now it's a seismitoad. All right. Um. Well, presumably you're a water type, right? So water should not be super damaging. Good. Bubble beam. I have been beamed with bubbles. Oh no, my speed fell. I need that to be quick. Oh, we're coming up on about a half hour, so I'll probably wrap up soon, but we got a bunch of stuff done. We finished a ghost's unfinished business. Um, flail? Hmm. I'm just going to try throwing another great ball. There we go. Seismitope was caught. Yeah, we finished a growth some finished business. We saw a bunch of cutscenes. We caught a bunch of stuff out here in Route 7. We'll probably get through Route 7 next video. We'll see how we go. 
This Pokemon is popular among the elderly, who say the vibrations of its lumps are great for massages. Ugh. Alright. Um... Steve. Go to a box, Steve. <laughs> see, that's what I thought I was fighting, that Gav Gavantula there, that you can see. Hmm. Anyway, um, yeah, so that's it for this video. I'm just gonna dive back to the Pokemon Center. Next time we will probably get through Route 7. Depends on how much stuff I have to catch. Um, I did catch a bunch of stuff just then, so that's a start. Pokemon Center, hello. Yes, please. Thanks, Nurse Joy. Or whatever your name is. I don't know if you're actually Nurse Joy. I can buy Ultra Balls. Okay, I wasn't, I wasn't sure how far I was. Boop, boop, ba, da, ba. Okay, so yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Next time, we'll probably get through Route 7. Maybe. I don't know how long it is. I only looked at the first little bit. Uh, just chuck down a save. There we go. And bye! <laughs>